another day, another wonderful morning. We're on to the next one. Let's do this. Spring just started. It's so gorgeous out. It, today it's going to be like a mix of sun and cloud, but who will complain, right? I won't complain. This is such a gorgeous day to be outside. And since, yes, spring means we can start going around and do travels. That's why we're here. It's about time. Dapat lang, no? Tagal na but of course, we're still, uh, you know, restricting our travels to just here around BC. But seriously, guys, you should try visiting BC, Vancouver, everywhere else in BC is really, really nice, and gorgeous, and lots of nature, you know, trails, everything else. If you are an outdoorsy person, this is the place to be. And really, it's just um, everything that you'll need. All right, let's go. Where are we going today? You'll know later. fantasy here I am falling down crashing down and I feel like I don't need you here I am falling down deep inside and I feel like I all right we're here in the ferry already parang roro <laughs> since BZ has a lot of islands around it we have this um, mode of transportation which is BC ferries that goes around the different um, islands and you can actually be a foot passenger or you can also bring your car of course it's more expensive if you bring your car but you know it's convenient as well and yeah it's an hour and a half trip to where we're heading in the meantime I'm gonna show you around this ferry Victoria, BC. Hi, first time here at the Fisherman's Wharf. Let's check it out. Okay, we're ready to eat. We got some fish and chips from Barb's. Mexican seafood with um, shrimp in it from the Mexican seafood restaurant. Oysters too from the fish store.
decided to just cap off the day here at the Sydney Bookend Pub. It's just at the ground floor of our hotel, which is Strathcona Hotel. There's a lot of people and there's actually a lineup outside, so it's pretty busy. It's a good way to cap off the day with bars of beer, and they actually have all day happy hour. And this is just for three dollars and fifty cents. They got the Wicked Logger, so. Cheers, guys. Welcome aboard. Hi. I'll be helping Hi, you guys out. Hope you don't Hi. mind if I take a video. Oh, yeah, go for it. <laughs> Thanks. I'm not shy. <laughs> Good. What was your name? Tiara. Tiara? Yeah. 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 Hi. All right. So if I got each of you take a look at the waiver, give a print and sign, and then I do need to hold on to one person's driver's license or photo ID if you've okay, got it. Okay, sure. And I'll uh, keep it here. I'll have it for you when you get back. Okay, sure. When you're done with the waiver, I'll play our orientation video for you guys up on the TV screen here. Okay. You guys can watch it, get changed. And then you guys will have this bin right here to store your uh, bags. Okay, oh, I sounds good. Thing. I'll okay. lock it for you while you're gone. Okay. Then I'll set you guys up with the mini speaker and you'll be out in the water. All, All right, right. Wow. sounds good. Great. Thank you. Good morning, guys. It's a Saturday morning. It's kind of cloudy. I think it, they said it's going to be a little cloudy with sun today. But um, yeah, it's a Saturday in Victoria and I think it's around, uh, maybe around like a nine degrees eight degrees Celsius or maybe ten degrees I'm not sure really but um, one thing that's so cool is where we are right now this is like the highlight of our trip you know what it is you know where we are we are in a hot tub boat and we're cruising along this bay sorry I can't remember what the name of the bay is but um, it's the only one here in Victoria, and it's really the highlight of our show. So yes, see how cool this is. comes with this hot tub boat well um, they will give you free water there you go and um, there's a um, protective case for your phone they have a radio just in case something happens you can just radio them and then they also will provide you with a Bluetooth speaker where you can just hook up your phone and play your tunes and I guess that's pretty much it. The rest is just experience. The boat is actually slow, guys. So these guys, the people who are canoeing, they're so much faster than this boat. <laughs> and they actually have this um, ladder too, which on warmer days <laughs> you can use to like just dip into the water. You can climb up the boat. But we wouldn't do that now. <laughs> it's too cold. The, the water's too cold. We'll definitely come back and try this out again. So I'll be able to swim out and try and have that experience. boat was amazing so we're off for uh, our lunch well, we're so hungry <laughs> we're gonna have our lunch and we found a Japanese restaurant and we're here still at downtown Victoria 
and we've come across some them cool wall murals. Check it out. Uh, this is just by the parking lot. That's cool. Okay, I got my popcorn roll and assorted tempura. Smells really good. I'm hungry. I'm ready to go. Later. What you got there? I've got sukiyaki. Let's give it a try. <laughs> Sweet sauce. Sweet. It's uh, because of you, <laughs> Courtney. <laughs> so, you know, we're out. So, we're here on our third stop, and it's in their Chinatown. And we're here to check out what they call Fantan Alley. They say that it's like the Diagon Alley in Hogwarts. I mean, sorry, in Harry Potter. <laughs> nah, it's just actually a narrow alley. So, let's check it out. Alright, so this is Fantan Alley, and you just step a little bit there and you'll be in Diagon Alley. <laughs> Look, it's a narrow alley here, and they got lots of um, stores, but we came in late. Most of them are closed, but it's okay. At least we get to experience this one. It's kind of cool. Check it out. So we're gonna go get grab some beer and find Saturday a night. Saturday. <laughs> we're gonna go find um, a nice brewery here. Let's see. I have to search Google first. <laughs> All right, guys. We're here at Whistle Boy Whistle Boy Brewery, and this is what we got. We got a flight of five. Got IPA, a pale current coffee and the Lojo Lager. And we also have the other one there, I believe that's, um, oh, we already have the Beast Milk Coffee. Um, I think the other one is an ale. All right, let's do this. Coffee. Mm. Tastes like coffee. Yeah, for sure, it has coffee, but so far, the Lojo and this one really tastes good. I like the, I like the mix, the taste. It's not too strong, but you, you really like taste the flavor. It's good. What's the, what is this? Curran. Oh, wow. Here we are. Thank you. Beautiful plate of uh, dozen Wow. Yummy! So, two types here. These guys are out of Salt Spring Island from Evening Co Farm. Okay. These are out of Cortez from Evening Co Farm. So oh, wow. These will be sort of cheap. Okay. Fresh horseradish, red wine, shallot, mignonette, banana bread, and hot sauce. Oh, wow. Really Thank you. Curran. Curran. Okay. Sorry about that. We got our oysters. Really good. We love oysters, right? Right, right now, here. Mm. That's sour. Sour. 
it's sour. Don't even really like this. It doesn't want sour stuff. Mm. Yeah, it's good. Um, it's okay. Not good. So far, this is a winner for me. The, the coffee. What's it? Uh, pale. Pale? Yeah. I don't know why I always love the straw stuff. This is a weird thing. Not, not really weird. I like it better. You know, the ale is actually, I think it's like how they brew it is these stuff so far. It's really good. Really? I, I tried some other breweries. I won't say which, but some of them are like, you know, um, it just tastes like weird, like the ale is strong, or IPA, those ones are strong, but, but, but they lack flavor. This, you really taste the flavor though. I like it. What's this, IPA? IPA. IPA is good. IPA is good. But I taste like some, some better, but this will do. It's good. So far, I like the ale and the coffee. Wow, it's that's good. great. Yeah. It's a rainy day guys and our last day we already checked out from the hotel and it's a good thing that our last day is when it rained so the first two days were actually sunny and um, gorgeous well cloudy a little bit but it was still gorgeous so now since it's rainy we decided to have our breakfast in a cafe and we were searching for a unique one and it being me, I love quaint places, artsy fartsy places and so we found this one, it's called Imagine Studio Cafe and Tony wanted this too, actually it was Tony who found this place because they have coffee art and so we got this they gave me this looks like a, is it a dragon or a snake <laughs> I don't know looks like a dragon to me but hers was a uh, specially she specially requested for this she wants a bear <laughs> it's so cute anyway we're still waiting for our food so later Have an hour to burn before heading back to the ferry so for our last stop we decided to check out this um, bookstore it's a big bookstore and it's uh, one of uh, the go-to places here in Victoria and it's um, the name is Russell books let's do this check it out
guys this is it for our vlog thank you so much for watching this and if you haven't subscribed yet please do and support me and uh I would love to share more travels with you and more music also and more adventures. So please like this video if you do and if you have any questions feel free to leave your comments or questions at the comments box and yeah that's it. On to the next one. We'll see you guys again. Thank you.